Hey guys, click on the link below and it'll take you to a web page with a zip file which will have every file and program that you're going to need to take care of this scheduling video. Hope you enjoy it and have fun. Peace. Alright guys, so I'm going to show you here how to get an updated schedule file for your dynasty. Uh, I figured a really simple way to do this. So the first thing you're going to do is just create a new dynasty using whichever roster file that you prefer. Create your offline dynasty. And right here, you're just going to click Begin Dynasty. And then pick whichever team you're going to use. We can always add more later. I'm just picking Michigan for the purposes of this video. So go through the, uh, the regular process here. Getting into your main Dynasty homepage here. And this is the 2013 default schedule for Michigan. Just for reference, we'll take a look at that real quick. By the end of this, we'll have a 2020 version. So what we're going to do is save our dynasty, and you need to save this to a thumb drive. So I have a formatted thumb drive in there. I'm going to create a new dynasty, and I'm just going to name it 2020. And I'm going to save it. And then what we're going to do is exit out of here take out your thumb drive and meet back at your computer okay so I plugged in my thumb drive to my computer I'm just showing you the name of the file that we just created right there and now we're going to open Modio which is included in the package okay once you have Modio open I'm just gonna drag it over here so you can see it a little bit better you're gonna hit open a save we're gonna navigate right into that thumb drive so click all the way through until we see the Dynasty 2020 hit open. Okay, now well, you're going to click on this tab here and we're going to do this twice. Right click, extract all, save one to your desktop, hit OK. Do it again, extract all and save one in your downloads. Okay, and leave that open and just minimize everything. And the next thing we're going to do is I'm going to go over to our desktop and you can see right here there's this Dynasty 2020. You're going to add a .mc02 to the end of the file. That's the important step. And now we hit File Open, navigate exactly to that file we just appended to. It's going to take a minute but it will load up here. And there's three CSV files that we're basically going to paste over the default file here. Um, this method is much easier than before. I just figured this out recently. It's, it's so much quicker. It's great. So the first thing we're going to do is update our schedule. So we're on organization schedule. You're going to import file and navigate to this package of three CSV files. You're going to open the one that underscore 2020 at the end. And now we're just going to look at the schedule to make sure it looks right. We're going to go to Michigan just to check out their home schedule. Uh, Wisconsin, Purdue, everything looks good there. So we're good to go. The next thing we're going to do is actually going to stay in the organization tab. Click on divisions doesn't really say divisions but anyway import and then you're gonna see a file that says organization division hit OK there and then we're just gonna save it last thing we're gonna do is going on teams into the teams tab import and you see teams teams underscore F okay and now there's just a couple things here we need to change to make this accurate so I went through and edited everything the best I could. For some reason, it won't save all of these correctly. But for these three here, East Carolina, Tulsa, and Tulane, who are in the American, you need to change the division to 30, which basically means no division. There's not going to be any divisions in the American Conference this coming season. And then also UMass. Uh, they switched to an independent. You need to change that to a 30 as well. And that's all we need to do in here. And one other thing I'm going to show you, if you want to add more teams as a user, you can see right here, user control. I have one team that's a user. You can see it's Michigan. 
You can add up to 12 total teams, so we could add 11 more if we wanted. For the purposes of this, I'm going to just add Arizona as another user team, head coach. And all you need to do is double click in there and just type in user as you see it above, capital U S E R. And now we're just going to hit save. And that's all the editing we really need to do. We need one more step. So what we're going to do is go back into this file and take off the .mc02, hit enter, hit yes. Okay, and the last step here, one of the last steps, we need to open our HXD editor. What you want to do is first you're going to open the file that you saved to the downloads that we did not touch. The Dynasty 2020, hit open. Next, you're going to want to open the file that we just edited from the desktop. 2020 right there. Hit open. And what we're going to do for this is we're going to highlight the top two rows here. Copy that. And click back over on the Dynasty file from the desktop. Highlight the first two rows. Right click and hit paste right. And this will turn red once you do that, which is okay. Hit Control S on your keyboard, and you're good to go. So now we can exit out of this. And now we're going to go back into Modio, into that open file, and we're going to center this for you. Right click, hit Replace File, and you're going to navigate to the desktop file right there, the Dynasty 2020. Hit Open. And now this is going to take about a minute to overwrite everything. Um, you'll be able to tell once you're able to click on that first tab there. So this will take just a second. Okay. And now once we can click on that, we're good to go. And what we want to do just to verify is go back into your thumb drive and check out the timestamp on it. Hit refresh. And you can see 345, it's 346, so that's good. We can exit out of Modio, and now we can eject our thumb drive. Okay, now we're back on our Xbox. We're going to go to our Dynasty screen, and you're going to hit X to load up from your thumb drive. And you can always hit R1 to see what the name of it. Um, that's the Dynasty 2020 we just created. Hit A to load it. Now we're going to make sure everything works. So we'll go down to custom schedules. And there you go. We have Michigan schedule for the hopefully upcoming 2020 season. Uh, we're just going to breeze through here just to show everybody how this works. It's really cool to be able to have an updated schedule in Dynasty every year. It's been a lot of time figuring this out. I'm really excited about it. And then right here, if you go to Dynasty Central, now we see two teams. We also added Arizona. So now we have the ability to perform all the dynasty tasks in there as well and you can check out their updated schedule so that's how you do it pretty simple and straightforward just a couple things follow along i uh, hope you guys really enjoyed this i know i've had a lot of fun figuring it out have fun michael kramer mjk peace out